Hey everybody, and welcome to part 9 of Pokemon Yellow version. I am Gametastic Koompa, and in the last episode, we did all of the SSN. And yeah, I forgot to save between the last, before the last two parts, so my Pokemon levels are a little off. Gusto is now level 21, once again he only learned Whirlwind. Seeds is level 24, Poison Powder, Piggles is level 25, Dimitri is 21, and Laser is 23. Our team is a little off in level, but... You know, it's not all terrible. And poor Gusto, though, seriously won't really get much action lately. Or, well, for a while. And I did teach Cut to, um, Seeds. Seeds, use Cut. Aya. So, let's go into the gym and fight Lieutenant Surge and his goons. Yo, champion making! Lieutenant Surge has a nickname. People refer to him as the Lightning American, because apparently America exists here yet. We're in made-up worlds, you sure. He's an expert on electric Pokemon. Birds and water Pokemon are at risk. Beware of paralysis, too. Lieutenant Surge is very cautious. You'll have to break a code to get to him. Okay, well, let's break that code. But first, let's fight every trainer here while my cat bites my arm. I'm a lightweight, but I'm good with electricity. Wait, lightweight? So you can only lift... So, but, what? Wait, you're a rocker? Why'd you say you're a light? Wait, what? Level 20? Holy cow. Dimitri? Use Ember of Death! The de 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 Deathany. Like, Destiny meets Death. So now we get Deathany, and that seriously didn't do much. Seismic Toss! At least Voltorb doesn't really have any good moves. Magnemite is more terrifying than Voltorb at this point. And one more Ember should be able to finish off. Oh god, Screech, that hurts the ears. Mm. I hope I got him up enough experience where that levels him up. It does, hopefully we learn something new. No, he seriously learns nothing. Well, let's see. Now we still don't have speed, but Screech failed at least. That really didn't do any better. That did not do any better at all. Yeah. Mm, Seismic Toss is really good. At least right now. Now we'll just see Scratch. And no, I'm not doing the Mew glitch in this, so yeah, don't expect me to get Mew. And then next is another Vault Orb. Yes. So I'm just gonna try and make a punch this time. See how much that does. Eh, yeah, decent damage. Not much better than. Seismic, or not much worse than Seismic Toss. Well, here we go. I mean, we got our water Pokemon after this. Then we have an entirely full team, which is a lot of Pokemon trained, but at least we'll be set. And then I can always train them off screen, too. That's not a big deal. Fried! You know, in this generation, you think there'd be like a bug gym because there's so many bugs, but. You never do fight bugs, it's crazy. Eh, let's fight this guy. This is no place for kids, yet, technically speaking, kids have to go out on a Pokemon journey alone, on their own at the age of 10, so it only makes sense. Anyways, we have Sailor, which has a Magnemite as his one and only Pokemon, it's level 24. I do not want to run into, um... A... Sonic Boom. Which is exactly what's gonna hit us. <clears throat> We're gonna have to heal after this, or at least grab some potions. That Magnemite is bulky, and then it just uses random tackle. That still did a lot. Jesus, oh wait, no, Sonic Boom won't kill us, luckily. We'll be left with 1 HP, but we'll still be alive. <sighs> and we missed! No! Of course, he doesn't miss with that. Oh, my lord. Gusto? Nothing in here is electric type, though, so... Or, I mean, like, electric moves. So Gusto might actually be able to do quite a bit in here. And there goes the neck might finally. Mm, yes, I did surprise you, eh? And poor Pikachu's gone. But Pikachu really isn't going to play much of a role here. 
And I believe this guy's a Pikachu. I think. When I was in the army, Lieutenant Surge was my strict CO. For those who don't know what CO means, it means commanding officer. Military son right here. Anyways. No, in this game he is Voltorb. I believe in all the other games he is Pikachu, but since Pikachu is like your special Pokemon in this, he doesn't. You can only survive three of those, which sucks, but eh. It literally sounds the exact same. That really won't hurt us unless he uses Tackle. And let's try Quick Attack. See how much that does. Eh. Or we're dead because of self destruct and Screech. Yeah, there's no way we're surviving that. Our health glitched back up, that was weird. And I guess Dimitri. Yeah, we have to heal after this battle for certain. Oh, weird, I get to swap Pokemon if I wanted to. Anyway, Seismic Toss. 22 points of damage coming at you. Ooh. Well, if he uses another tackle, we might actually have a chance of winning. Please pray to the Poke Gods, pray to Arceus that he doesn't use Sonic Boom. Yes! We win, Scratch! Perfect. Awesome. And I also level up to 23, but still no new move. Stop! You're very good. Now we have to go heal up our Pokemon because I don't want to fight Lieutenant Surge without, you know, healed up Pokemon. So, no, you know, Seeds is the one who has it. I can't believe Seeds leveled up as much as it did. Like, Seeds leveled up crazily fast. Hey, and I'll speed up the Pokemon healing. I'll see you back in a second. Okay, we're back near the tree and... Wait, what? Alright, never mind. My Pokemon aren't healed. I'll, uh... <sighs> meet you back again. Okay, we're back again, once again. All with our healed up Pokemon. Let's go fight Lieutenant Surge again. Or, well, not again. For the first... Can you turn? Thank you. For some reason he wasn't turning. I broke part of my nail, so it hurts every time I touch something. Now we gotta look for the switches. Nope, trash. Nope. Hey, there's a switch in here. Over here. And there we go. Now we just gotta fight a Raichu, which as annoying as it is, we should be able to beat it. Turn! Huh? Welcome to Vermilion Gym! Really look at that, a pint-sized challenger! Haha, <laughs> you've got big and brassy nerves to take me on with your puny power. A Pokemon battle is war. I'll show you, civilian. I'll shock you into surrender. Oh god, he's gonna electrocute a poor innocent kid. Crazy guy from Street Fighter wants to battle. Sent out Raichu, level 27, I believe. 28 oh. Gusto! Use quick attack! I'm just gonna get off as much damage as possible. Oh god, I know it's Mega Punch. And we can't evolve our Pikachu, which really sucks. Oh man, that damage is insane. An X speed? Oh man. That's insane. We didn't know that he used it second turn, not first turn. I think it's not X attack. I'm sorry, Pidgeotto. Um. Seeds? Let's get off a uh, Leech Seed. Oh, he also knows Mega Kick. Which I believe is more powerful, but has less PP. And the accuracy isn't that much better. God, knows Thunderbolt. How much that's gonna do? We actually ate that up pretty well. Oh, I wonder if Seeds is actually gonna win this for us. Seeds might win this. Oh my god, he's gonna actually win. Not who I wanted to win, but still, he's gonna win. And he won. Whoa! You're the real deal, kid! Fine then, take the Thunder Badge! The Thunder Badge cranks up your Pokemon speed. It also lets your Pokemon fly anytime, kid. You're a special kid, take this! Ooh, Thunderbolt. DM24 contains Thunderbolt! Teach it to an electric Pokemon! 
Well, Pikachu does need a better electric type move, so right now, that is probably our best use of it. I know he learns it later, but uh, the only other Pokemon we can teach it to is Piggles, and Piggles is not a special attacker. So, yeah. So, let's get rid of... Let's actually get rid of Quirk Attack. Don't need that. I want Thundershock for weaker Pokemon. And then we should also be able to get our next teammate just outside the gym, and then we'll continue on. We're not going to end the episode here, just because I do want to get a little more done in these episodes than we have been, so, you know. Hey, Officer Jenny, you have the Thunder Badge! You must be a good trainer. I just caught a squirrel that was always getting into mischief. Would you take good care of it? Yes, I would. And we'll name that Squirtle, and we'll name it... We'll name it Hydro. In the hopes that in this Let's Play slash walkthrough, it will get the awesome move known as Hydro Pump. Okay, please treat Squirtle right. Well, obviously, you know what our first Pokemon we're going to have to use is. So, switch with you. Then you. Then you. And then you. Poor Gusto, man. He literally gets used like once or twice here and there. Just not many Pokemon he's good against because in this game, Gust is normal. When we get Fly, it'll be helpful. But anyway, see you in a second. Okay, we're healed. Let's go. Now, what we have to do is wait. Actually, before we do anything at all, I gotta deposit some stuff. Since we don't need Cut or anything anymore, let's deposit it. Um. RPC. Deposit item. We don't need the town map. Uh, we don't need uh, the SS ticket, and we don't need cut. And there we go. Okay, now we can actually find those water. I uh, what's this one? Wait, no, bide. We still gotta get rid of that. I forgot because I for did that in one of the last episodes. And anyway, Hydro learned water then. Okay, good. And Thunder Wave, not really useful. And Bubble Beam. Trying to learn Bubble Beam, I'm pretty sure he has like Growl or Withdraw. And a Tail Whip, so we'll get rid of Tail Whip. He has so many water moves, it's crazy. And then, yeah, that should be it. So let's go get our bike and continue our journey. Uh, the beautiful music of an old Gen 1 Pokemon game. Nothing beats that. Nothing at all. And all those Pokemon Go players are freaking insane lately. Like, they're seriously insane. They're like all over Central Park. They're all over dead bodies and this and that. It's just way too crazy. I don't think Pokemon thought that through very well. Apparently there's a way you can glitch it too where you don't actually ever have to go anywhere. So, that's another thing. But alas, still no Pokemon Go available in my country, legally at least. It is weird, on this game you actually look like you're holding a rail. Though I know it's not a rail because you can walk through it. Now that we have cut the slow bro that was sitting here is out of the way, so then we can go to seeds and use cut. Now we can go in here and talk to the bike owner and he'll give us a bike. So we'll get that out of the way, don't need to talk this. Now we can continue on with our journey. Luckily, we shouldn't have to heal too much. Because the route coming up is fairly simple, I guess. And there's a Pokemon Center at the end of it before you go into Rock Tunnel, which will be obviously next episode for sure. Oh, God, that place is annoying, especially if you don't have Flash. Oh, I forgot to go to Diglett's... Diglett Tunnel. I'll actually probably meet you guys there in the next episode, like, or the next episode, we'll probably do that. But as of right now, I guess we'll go this way, and I'm pretty sure this person does not have something, um, Hydro can beat, so, whatever. Let's see. You have Pokemon with you! You're mine! I'm, like, wanna date me, crazy lady? You wanna date me? Nah, I'm not your type. Woo -hoo. Oh, Oddish. Only Gust was a flying type attack. That would be perfect right now. Here, 
really would be. Aha! Your, your stun spark did not work, luckily. Thank god. That was a crit. That crit was really weak there, Gusto. You are not proving to be a very good member to this team. No offense. And we leveled up to 22. That helps. And this person seems like they're going to be using a lot of, um... Uh, grass types, so we'll be using Dimitri for this fight. I just still don't get where he got the horn from, but Ember! Five levels above, let's see how much Ember does. And it's a 2 a KO. Hmm, going to increase your special. Oh, well, too bad you're out of here. And another Oddish. Yeah, I believe it's two Oddish, two Bellsprout. At least you don't fight them the same ones in a row. Like, two Oddishes in a row, then... Are you kidding me? I can't even buy Antidotes in the frickin' Pokemon, or Pokemon Mart. That is just rude, game. Like, why? Poor Dimitri, like, never gets you... Oh, at least crit. At least he doesn't take poison damage from that. Ugh. You deceived me! Wait, how did I deceive you? You said I had Pokemon. That's all you did. I believe this is a burn heal. Wait, no, in this game it's TM30. What's TM30? Teleport. Wow, useless move. Useless move. And now Hydra can actually fight the next trainer. At least I'm hoping it can. Wah! Great! I was bored, eh? Wait, is this guy Canadian? It's the Canadian hiker. Hey, with his pixelated beard. Pixelated neck beard. Really? I send out the Pokemon just for it to be a freaking Machop. Um... Laser, I guess? You have Thunderbolt now. That might help. And low kick. What a low blow, man. Freaking hurts a lot, still. At least that'll hurt him back. And it's a one hit KO. Nice. And Hydra's level 11. Talking about easy level up. And there is an Onyx. That's something we can fight. Go Hydro! It's only level 20. We're only 9 levels below. But that's why we have the powerful Bubble Beam. Oh god, Rock Throw Miss. Thank god. Oh, and it almost... That's so sad. Ah, I missed two rock throws. That's so sad. Poor Pokemon. <laughs> yes. Keep it coming, eh? Oh, wait, I'm out of Pokemon. I didn't realize he's gonna say something again. Oh, the poor poison. Eh. I'm so sorry, Pokemon. I believe this guy actually has fire types. I aim to be the ultimate trainer. I guess it's actually a good dream in the Pokemon world. Wait, you're not the fire guy, are you? Oh, you still have a Sandshrew. May not be fire, but it's still ground. I wonder how much scratch will do. It'll probably hurt, but it won't do... Okay, we're... Maybe? With the speed drop, I think we'll actually win. Yeah, because 19 plus 19 is not 35. Yo, barely, but we did it. You know Bubble Beam loses the sound effect, though? It's weird. Hello, 14! My Sandshrew lost? Wait, you so your only Pokemon in the entire game was Sandshrew. I gotta go back now. Can't go back. Repeat, we can't go back. go all the way up here. Wait. No, you're the guy who uses, um, bug types, right? Okay, we'll fight you, I guess. I got up early every day to raise my Pokemon from cocoons. Yep, he's the bug trainer. But at least this bug uh, catcher evolved his Pokemon. Let's see what he starts off with. Beedrill. That Pokemon looks so badass. Now it's not that strong of a Pokemon, but it does look cool. Yeah, see those the never mind. 
Wow, Dimitri's level 24, lucky. I'm trying to learn... That's what it learns, is rage and step... No, you're not gonna learn rage. Rage is stupid. And another bee drill. Maybe we'll see how much Ember actually would normally do without a crit. Should do more than half since a crit finishes... Yeah, that's nice. Just don't use Fury Attack or something. Oh no, Fury Attack. See, that bee drill, though it be level 19, still isn't very strong. And we should be able to finish off the scratch. Yup. What? And he goes, what a total waste of time. It's, dude, your Pokemon were fine, but I had a fire type. I'm not gonna be one of those guys who goes, yeah, your Pokemon just suck. So, cut, please. And yeah, let's go. Okay, let's go heal up. I'll speed up the heals. Okay, we're back in action. At least I thought there was going to be a trainer, though, that had fire type back there. Yeah, not much to talk about on the way. He, uh... Live on, like, the remake, you actually click the table there and it says that it was damaged. Like, in the act of a theft. Okay, we're back here. Eh, cut. So we got a few trainers to be. This should definitely be less than a half an hour episode. Next episode, I... Mm, don't know how long it's gonna be. I can't tell you that. Not yet. Oh, Hiker. As long as you don't have a Machop, I'm pretty sure Hydra will have fun taking you down. Ha ah, ha ha! Come on, dude! I ain't no dude, punk. Anyways, we have Geodude! So we gotta fight him first. Level 21. And Bubble Beam him up. Nice one hit KO. At level 15, to top it all off. And an Onyx! This time we should be able to one-shot it. Bubble Beam! Oh, it actually has sped us. Ooh, if it hits with Rock, uh, throw, that'll hurt. But I don't think he'll get the opportunity to. Nope. And now we get to see him evolve. Ha ha ha, you beat me fair! And yay, we get another evolution. Now everyone evolves at 36. Ah, beautiful war turtle. Oh, there's not even an item down here. What a waste. Such a long walk, too. It's like the walk to the mall from where I live. Ah, uh, this guy. Normal types? I don't know, I'm gonna switch into Gusto, just to have neutral damage. Go, my super bug Pokemon! Oh, he's actually a bug catcher, okay. Did not expect him to be a bug catcher. Oh, is he the guy who has Caterpie, Weedle, and Venonat just to, like, throw you off? I believe he is. Which is kinda cool. Makes things a little different. Gusto, you are proving to be a useless member of society. And strength shot, go figure. Quick attack! Goodbye, Caterpie! Like, he doesn't even get good experience, that's the, th that's the thing. Like, my like water and grass Pokemon, with the Pokemon they can actually beat, they get so much experience, but, uh. I need fly, but we don't get there for quite a while still. A few episodes, maybe like two or three. Like after the next one I'm gonna record, but... Eh. And yeah, last but not least is Venonat, a new Pokemon. Looks cool, it's purple. Such a purple Pokemon. That's a little more bulky than the other Caterpillars. Still like a Caterpillar Pokemon though. It kinda is, it evolves into a moth and just not a butterfly or a bee. And level 25, not too shabby. My bugs. 
Uh, there's a hiker up there. Oh no, this is the fire train. Really? I'm taking Rock Tunnel to go to Lavender. Why, why do you have that in, within ellipses? He has four Pokemon. Starting things off with Rattat. Oh no, he actually has a normal Pokemon first. Okay. Yeah, we'll just use Gust. Eh, can we finish in two hits? Barely. It's gonna do almost as much as our Gust did. See, that's the sad part. Like, Gusto just isn't that good. I almost regret picking him up. Like, he's almost dead already. And next is Diglett. Well, Diglett is fast, but I'm pretty sure Hydro can beat it with the Bubble Beam. Don't worry, Diglett, we get to go through your tunnel here in a bit. But meet my Water Gun! I haven't got to use Water Gun yet, so I kind of want to use it. Oh no, it lived! Bubble! Oh god, use Dig. Oh god, we're dead. God, we're gonna die, we're gonna die, we're gonna die. No, we didn't die. Oh, goodbye. <clears throat> that Diglett lived. That Diglett just frickin' lived. Oh my lord. Thanks, Diglett. Ekans! Okay, hopefully we can beat this. And maybe. Oh god, no spite. As long as it doesn't do 8 damage, we'll actually survive this. Maybe we'll level up to 23. Let's hope so. Is it didn't use poison thing. Nope! It finished this off. Um. Laser? Laser, use Thundershock. You at least can finish off an Ekans. And then Sandshrew. Well, I don't want to risk um, Hydro dying yet, so we'll just send out Seeds. Seeds, use Vinyl. Ah, it didn't live. Nice. Can't measure up. Yeah, your dick's too small, dude. I'm sorry. Yeah, I believe in one of the later games he has uh, different Pokemon, but still. Anyways, let's send out Hydro. Ha ha ha! Aren't you a little toughy? How do you know I'm tough? Thank you for the compliment, but I'm not a little toughy. I'm a big toughy. You and your Geo dude piece of crap. I don't even know what Geodudes are, man. Bubble Beam! Stupid rocks. Actually, I know what they are. They're just rocks with arms that are alive. Oh, and Machop. Congratulations. We have something evil. Something pure evil. Okay, Pickles. Low kick it. I haven't got to see you in action forever. Still didn't actually do that much. You still do so much to me, though. Pretty sure my karate chop would have just barely did that. And there's another Geo dude. So once again, Hydro can easily take you down. So let's use Bubble Beam. And there it goes. And level 17 of that. What's that? Okay, guys. Actually, anyways, in the next episode, what we're going to do is we're going to finish this route and then go to Diglett's Tunnel. It's been a 29-minute episode. Don't want to head over the half an hour mark. Anyways, see you guys next time for some more Pokemon Yellow version.